all you starfighters out there, Commander Kingfish here, and I am back in Starfield, and we are doing side missions today. So there's a couple, at least I know there's one up here that we can get, and it's right up here. Uh, it's Doc Manning, and it's at Reliant Medical Clinic, and I believe he is struggling to get supplies because something popped up when I was uh, trying to get supplies myself from him so let's see what he has to say okay where's the doc at is that him right here sitting yeah here's the doc hey doc please state the nature of your medical emergency hey I want to talk I want to talk to you hold still Quit looking away from me. Come on. Come on, dude. Talk to me. Oh, my goodness. Another poor soul. Oh. All right. Tell me what happened to you. Is it an Aurora overdose? No, no. Something else, perhaps? No. Actually, I was just touring the clinic. Uh, let's see. Uh, yeah. Oh, well, that's quite unusual, but you're welcome here just the same. Since you're clearly a first-time visitor to Reliant Neon, I'd love to offer you a free checkup, but I'm afraid I'm dangerously low on supplies. Ah, okay. Must have been a busy day then? Every day is a busy day here, but that isn't why I'm low on supplies. Okay. You see, I'm a bit at odds with the current administrator of Neon. His drug is turning the streets into a graveyard, and he doesn't seem to care. We've argued about it on more than one occasion, and all he's done is try to persuade me to quit. Well... Thinning out my supply chain is his newest tactic. Bayou obviously has a stranglehold on this entire city. Or there's got to be a way to get around his blockade. There is, actually. But it requires... outside assistance. At this point, I've resorted to asking anyone that has a ship registered outside of the Voli system to bring me medical supplies. I pay them for the supplies, of course, but it's the only way I can sneak them past Bayou's people at the spaceport. Now, if there's anything else I can do for you, anything at all, you just let me know. Well, uh, let's see. Uh, I could, let's see. Uh, I don't want to talk about Aurora. I don't need medical supplies. I don't need help. I can help. I guess it's this one right here. That would be amazingly helpful. It's a relief to meet someone who gives a damn about anyone other than themselves for a change. Huh. Oh, and I'll pay you directly for the supplies, of course. It's the only way I can sneak them past Bayou's people at the spaceport. It's ridiculous that you have had to resort to smuggling and there's nothing else to be done about it these people need my help anyway I have a contact over at the clinic in the Narian system Abby Edding she's one of the nurses there she'll get you started thank you so much for doing this okay you have no idea how helpful it'll be for the poor folk that live in Ebside all right uh speak with abby edding and so uh i guess i don't need anything else from the good doc if you need help remember reliant okay for sure doc all right so we are off to see abby edding i believe let's step back outside here i think i gotta put uh Put this in yeah we don't have any missions so relief run speak with Abby Edding okay all right so when I get over towards wherever Abby's at I will uh, catch back up with you all okay we are here inside the space station 
Uh, let's uh, go see if we can find this Abby. Uh, where's she at? She's over here. Cool spacesuit. Here she is. Hey, Abby. Need, I need something? Yes, I do. Are you here for a procedure? No. Joseph Manning sent me to pick up some medical supplies. Hey, let's keep our voices down. The clinic doesn't exactly know I'm giving its supplies away. Oh. That being said, I've been expecting someone soon. I've heard Bayou really has a vice grip on Neon right now. I have some supplies I can give you. Should be more than enough for now, and it shouldn't draw any suspicion from the clinic. Okay. I'll have them loaded onto your ship. Okay. Thanks for the help. Uh... Well... No, we don't want to get her in trouble. Thanks for your help. Of course. The people of Neon aren't going to heal themselves. You'll find the supplies on your ship. Hurry along before anyone suspects anything. All right. Okay. Back to the ship. I think I got the... What do you call them? Horns? Oh, yeah. God. Okay. All right, back to the ship. All right, so now we should have medical supplies on the ship. Let's see if they're here. Medical supplies. Okay, I wonder if I need to... Let's see what it says. All right. Return to Joseph. Okay, we can do that. All right, I tell you what. Once I get back to Joseph, we will... Uh, uh, I will catch up with you. Okay, we're back here at Reliant Medical. Let's go in and see Joseph, and uh, let's let him know the good news. Joseph, buddy, Please how you doing? The nature of your medical emergency. Hey, I need to speak with you. Hold still. Hold still, man. Come on. You aren't looking well at all. Perhaps you'd better sit down. Wait a minute. I'm fine. Uh, I got the medical supplies for you. Great. Thank you for all of your help. You really came through for me here. Things could have been bad if you hadn't come along. Okay. Yeah, take this. You've earned it. Let's see what we got. 2,100 credits. And we got uh, 110 uh, experience points out of that. Well, okay. So let's go see. I have another one that I want to do, but uh, we helped old Doc Manning out there. And so let's uh, just double check. A little bit of... Uh, little bit of experience points all right uh, we don't want to go back to that yet uh, which one was it there was another one is it this one? Oh, I need to I think it was this one let's uh, I think he was the guy that uh, when we first came to neon all right so let's Let's see if we can set course. Let's see where he's at. Fast travel to Newell. Uh, yeah, I guess so. Well, hold on. I'm already at Neon. So let's see if we can just put this in. Let's see if it gives me... Okay, yep. He's right over here. All right, so we're going to go talk to Tevin. And see what kind of trouble he was in. He was getting picked up by the uh, spaceport. And let's see here. So why did you drag me in here? You said you wanted to buy something nice for your girlfriend, so here we are. Uh, Kevin, all of our items are guaranteed to be of the highest quality. Range. Okay. <sighs> are you sure you're in the right place? You certainly don't look like one of yeah, the okay. usual well, clientele. And then the uh, all that matters is I've brought credit to spend. Damn, yeah, I, I almost Take a look wore my entitled snob outfit today. I'll help you out, okay? Uh... <laughs> I take it from your tone I've made an error in judgment. Yeah. Please forgive my disrespect. We have quite a few, shall we say... Thugs that find their way into my establishment and create a disturbance. Oh, okay. In fact, there's a particular Seoka member who calls himself Headlock, 
who repeatedly torments me by damaging my goons. Oh. Uh, talk to the authorities. They'll help you. Ah, yes, the authorities. Neon security. <laughs> Corrupt, bumbling idiots who couldn't solve a crime if it occurred right in front of their faces. Oh, seriously? Anyway, I've already taken up too much of your valuable time. Was there anything else I could help you with? Uh, let's see. What's Seguko? The Seoka Syndicate, of course. I'm surprised you haven't run into any of them. They're a group of organized criminals who use threats and violence to push their own agenda. And honest people like me tend to suffer the consequences. They're based out of Neon, but no one is certain who runs the syndicate. Could be anyone. I, I'm not sure I've gotten through. I need to talk to you about something. only the finest goods for the discerning customer. I can see. Okay. Uh, I'll handle this headlock thug for you. Oh, my goodness. That's such a relief. You have no idea. Thank you for accepting my offer. Headlock's quite a dangerous gentleman. I believe you can find him hanging out somewhere in Epside near Frankie's Grab and Go. Okay. Uh, I don't think this will be a problem. Uh... You say that, but Seoka aren't exactly pushovers when it comes to this sort of thing. So you better watch your ass. Okay, I can Anyway, do that. that's really all I know. Head back here when you've taken care of the situation. Good luck. Okay. All right. Come back soon. You never know what we'll have for sale. Okay, so I need to... All right, let's see what we got here. We need to put this in. Uh, mob mentality. Ask Frankie about... Headlock. Okay, let's see here. Uh, what I should be wearing for a... Well, we'll leave this on in case there's some persuasion. But somehow I got a feeling that uh, we might be running into a little bit of uh, extracurricular activity. All right, so we got to go see Frankie. All right, see where Frankie's at over here. Where is Frankie? Oh, yeah. I think we probably got to go down to Ebside. Yep, here we go. All right. Let's get down to Ebside down here and see what uh, uh, Frankie has Stay to safe, say. Buddy. Okay. Venom Savage's place. Let's see. Frankie, Frankie. Nice. All right. Let's see if we can get around here. Where's Frankie You're out there at? a lot, right? In space? Uh, Frankie, where are you? Got to get to you. Frankie's grab and go. All right. Frankie, hey. Then I have credits to spend. Oh, I do if I want to, but... You lost, kiddo? No. Uh, I, uh, last I checked, I was an adult. Uh, ah, just something I call everyone. Nothing to get worked up over. Okay. I had some high hopes for this shop back when my husband and I opened it a while back. These days, if you ain't a regular, you're usually trouble. Yeah. Uh, I get it. Trusting anyone is hard these days. Mm-hmm. Sounds like we understand each other then. Uh, Tevin and Asty told me a thug named Headlock hangs around here. Never heard of him. Now, are you gonna buy something or just annoy me all day? Ah. Uh, you know what? Here's 500 credits. Maybe this will jog your memory. Well, now that I know you're serious, we can talk business. Yeah, I know Headlock can't stand him. And I heard some of the other Sioka can't either. Ah. That boy doesn't know how to keep himself out of trouble. What'd he do this time? He's been terrorizing the Emporium. Hmm. Well, if any place should be terrorized, it may as well be the Emporium. In any case, if you're so desperate to find him, he and his friends are probably hanging out in Warehouse 4 or somewhere near there. Okay. I gotta ask, what are you gonna do with him? Ah, uh, 
he needs to face some justice. Uh, I'm not sure. Do I want to shake him down? Uh, I just want to talk to him. <laughs> That's one way to punish him. <laughs> you'll just bore him to death. Sure, why not? Now, if you'll excuse me, I have a business to get back to. If you aren't going to buy anything, you better run along. Ah, sure, Frankie. Well, let's see. What do you got for sale? Take a look. Uh, what kind of aid do you have? Oh, all kinds of stuff. All right. Anything worth buying, though? Uh, yeah, that, that's worth buying. Let's get one of those. Okay, there you go, Frankie. Helping you out a little bit. Come again. Yep, you bet. All right, let's go find this, uh... Uh, what the hell was his name? Uh, Headlock. Let's go find Headlock. And actually, I think I do need to change up suits a little bit here. Let's, uh, see. Let's put in the Space Rogue outfit. That'll be a little bit better. Not that it will help much. Uh, but it'll at least look better. And, uh, which weapon do we got in? We've got the Urban Eagle. Uh, we only got 39 rounds of that, so let's, let's swap that out. Uh, we've got, uh, well, we got a hell of a lot on that. So let's go ahead and put the Eon in. And, actually, so that's, uh, 640. Yeah, let's go ahead and go with the Eon. We've got a boatload of rounds in that. Somehow I got a feeling we're going to have to deal with uh, Headlock. All right, let's go see if we can find old Headlock down here. Maybe we'll get a little bit of action today. Huh? Round this away. We're going, we're going to Warehouse 4. How do we get to there? Maybe up these stairs and around. Get out of the way. Okay, around and around. Uh-huh. Here we go. Warehouse 4. Just like Frankie said. Okay. He's walking around in there. All right, old headlock. There's headlock down there. Yeah, I got a funny feeling we're going to be uh, taking this old boy out. I'm not going to mess around. We don't you mess around with anything? thugs. You're dead. Hey, Headlock. Don't you're walk not here to do business, you best leave before we get pissed off. And who do we have here? You here for business or to get your head caved in? Ah, oh, well. You know, you need to leave the Eporium alone. Is that so? I'm not just some low-life thug anymore. I'm with the Sioka now. You mess with me, you'll mess with the whole syndicate, and that won't end well for you. Eh. That doesn't worry me. Well, it should. All I need to do is say the word, and my Sioka buddies will pay you a very unpleasant visit. So go on, Hotshot. Give me a reason why I should leave Tevin and his shitty little store alone. Ah, uh, you know what? You're getting pretty annoying. Last mistake you'll ever make. What? Oh, uh, come on, move. Move, 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 move. All right, come on, come on. Where are you guys at? There's a couple more here. All right, there's one more. Little bit of action. Where'd he go? Where are you at? Oh, you're hiding over here. There you go. All right. Well, Headlock is not going to give these any trouble. So we might as well loot everything. Loot these guys. Take the credits. And can sell off the guns. Uh, one more 
over here. Syndicate thug suit. Might need dad. Who the hell knows? Uh, okay. Well, I'm not sure what that one stuff was it's back over here in the crate. Authentic manifold. I don't know. I don't think it's worth a hell of a lot. Okay. All right. We can uh, put uh, this away. And. Uh, nah. We don't need to loot this place out. So let's go back and see Tevin. Hey, Tevin, don't look so trodden. Yes. Hey, can got good news for you. To the Emporium. I took care of uh, Headlock. He won't be messing around with you anymore. Oh, my. Now that is a true relief. I thought I would never be rid of him. Well, he's gone I'm now. I'm not one to get involved with the rabble. So I'm glad you came along when you did. Thank you for your help. All right, 3,000 credits? 100 XP? That's always good. What do you got for sale anyway? I'm sure you'll find the perfect gift. What do we got? We've got aid. Art paste? No. Solomon's calculations. Uh, value? Ah, we don't need that book. We probably already have it in the library. And everything else is just pretty much all garbage. Just small decorations and whatnot. Ah, sorry, Tevin. I already took care of your problem. Please visit us again if you're in the market for luxury items. Yep. Okay, you got it. The Aporium. Let's look around. Let's see what we got. Oh, look, look at that. Antique boy motorcycle. Heart. I can't pay right now, but I'll spot you next time. Okay? Do I look like an idiot? Tell what? me, do I have a sign that says idiot taped to my back? N no. I know what you've been wasting your money on. Oh, All right. Junkies. Let's step out of here. I think Tevin can handle that. Okay. Well, there's a couple of... Let's get away from the rabble. God, it's so noisy out here. All right. Well, there's a couple of side missions today. We finally took care of that one that we uh, uh, had gotten uh, to talk to Tevin when we first arrived here on Neon. So that one's off the books. And then we took care of some uh, medical supplies for old uh, uh, for the doc. So. All right. Quit rabbling. I'm trying to talk here. Anyway. Anyway, if uh, you like this video, please hit that thumbs up. It really will help out the video. And uh, please subscribe. That will really help the channel. All right, and ring that bell. Don't forget to ring that bell. It will always let you know when I'm uploading new videos. All right, all you starfighters out there, keep your heads low and don't get shot. And with that, Commander Kingfish is out of here. And I will see you all in the next video. Thanks for watching, everyone.